Isn't LC seen as a bit of a risk, though? It can be, but there's... I've seen an LC Earthshaker uh, dual lanes. Okay. There it is. Hey, yeah, they pick it right away. It. Good call. Good Very call. Nice call. It's, it's, uh, it puts a lot of pressure, too, because you can you can spam your spells a lot. The hero that everyone revolves around, and he doesn't buff everyone up. The healing ward is all right, but nothing like the Lunar Blessing or the Precision Aura. Oh, I mean, look at this. This could get messy for Adfenim OG. Smoked up in a very good position to find something they're going to find. And maybe next time the five of them surround him. Arrow timing on point from OG. And they will claim first blood for Anna as well on that Dragon Knight. A very good matchup against the next assassin. Mana, not an issue. You have moment of courage, no big deal. And he just hits a lot harder. Ooh, top lane though, the setup again. Disruption into Arrow. OG picking up a second. And already starting to, in order to avoid being caught out by, by this trio of OG. Well, look how scared they are in that lane. Like, how are you supposed to see us when you're I, constantly look scared at Adam. of dying? He's, he's in a lot of trouble here. He'll pop the illusion rune. Turn him on the dragon trap of the Fisher from MMT. Absolutely beautifully done. And they will get their first kill on the board. Puck with that one kill on the Dragonite, it's going to be huge for him. And now he has raindrops to prevent the likelihood of that happening, but still, they have to worry about Madara. Oh, again, Madara potentially massively out of position here, Ch stuck in the tree line. I don't think there's any way that he can make his way out of this. He's going to try and juke it out. A good telekinesis will hold OG back, but Jerax jumps forward, will chase him down. Madara turns with a loose and beam, but the right clicks are too much here. Jerax, oh, he's toying with him. He's playing with him there. Oh, Jerax being a little cheeky. He's 1-0 and 3 right now, and we all know how disruptive uh, early act time is. Oh, Spartan gets arrowed up at the T1 tower. They ping him out. And he doesn't have any help. He's on his own at the moment. With the disruption into potential blade fury from no tail. Jerax falling low, though, and Jerax, oh, okay. He will be brought down with this. And at the same time, down bottom, Skylark and Madara were able to find the S4 kill. So, three-on-one situation, getting a kill like that, that's big. And Skylark will switch up to the top lane. I think Skylark plus one is going to be a much safer lane for them. If Ooh, mid lane. Do have the setup. Dragon Tail coming in. The arrow to connect as well. Thug taken down. Spawn on with the Telekinesis on to fly. See if he can find anything in return. But is it going to be the case? So... Oh, the Fissure didn't actually connect with the Nick Assassin there. They really needed that chain disable to stomp him from double stunning them. Thug spots out Jerax. Good silence, couldn't land the Teddy Kill, they dropped the Dream Coil, Leap still on cooldown, and they found it there! Nice usage of the Courier right there. He thought that he could position himself and perhaps leap down the cliff, so that LC wouldn't get a duel off, but that vision from the Courier allowed him to duel him from what looked like uh, was from across the tree. Oh, mid lane, a good Bishop block here for maybe next time. Could warrant another kill for Abfinim. Anna's got two points in the Dragon's Blood, turns around with a good stun to hold back the Legion. MNT gets the passive proc off! And Abfinim, they're stepping it up in game three, but no tail, he is also bringing in the level up of his play as well. So I don't think they're gonna get wind of this. And Nyx Assassin, is he gonna be able to be around this? Can he get this MNT? Looking to set up with a Fisher from Smoke. No tail immediately Blade Fury packing up underneath the tower, falling low, tries for a Fisher block, but no tail finds his way for the trees, but they do get the duel, bringing no tail back in and down. Iron Man T holding back the Nyx Assassin, mass TP's coming through from OG. They'll look towards MNT, Scarlet purging off the stun with the press of the attack, but they'll lose the Earthshaker nonetheless. Fox coming in from the side. Oh, good Dream Coil onto two as well, Thug. Jumping across, they're brought down low. Good Q here, drop from Skylark, he moves back in. Focusing the DK, you get DK, stunning up Thug, holding him back, but Skylark's not done. Moving in for more, bringing them down low, but the Star Soul for Jax. Nearly pulled Skylark, Jax, finish, jumps forward. Goodness off one, turns towards Thug, trying to find another kill, but Spartan takes him out. They're lost to one OG, and after the mark, they're yet, they're looking to dive deep. Banner of Pops the Eclipse, trying to move in range. He can't quite get himself there, but Thug can. Jumps with the silence and Finnum! They'll find three on this top lane! Incredibly tanky there. Also, nice purge from the Legion Commander. That This level 4 overwhelming odds is actually destroying them in these early fights. Oh, really is, but no tell as well. He's trying to play for the kill here. He needs backup Skylark. Is he going to get it? There's going to be a TP coming across, but no tell trapping Skylark in the tree line. Skylark trying to duke it out, but Skylark's taken out. No tell sort of trapped here, though. Maybe next time, the only one at the moment, he'll Fisher block him up. But there's no further backup coming in for Abfinim. So No Tail will get away with that kill.
Dog in the mid. Oh, Jerax hitting arrows like this. Fly holds back Spartan, making sure that there's no save for MNT. But MNT, he may just even all. He's not going to get himself out. Spartan stole the Moonlight Shadow, used it himself. A sentry's going to drop. It wasn't enough to save the Shaker, but it may just be enough to save himself. In fact, they're chasing under the tower. Telekinesis onto Jerax, bringing him in. No tell. Moving forward with the Blade Fury. Matter is keeping it across. And he get the kill. No tell. Hiding in the tree line. Healing ward out as well. Unlikely that Madara is going to have the damage on his own, but they are bringing in Thug as well on the puck. It's scary for Madara, and he has revealed himself. They may be ready to dive. Madara needs backup. He needs the team with him. They're heading over. They've scanned in the jungle, so they know that OG's hiding there. But again, Jerax hitting these arrows. The TP comes across, but it immediately is going to be cancelled. I think they realize that Madara is pretty much good as dead. They will get the heal no Skylight, trying to save him, but it's a good start coming through. MST hit the two-man Fisher, holding the back. Echo Slam and Jewel onto the Shadow Demon, bringing him down. They'll get the kill. More solid damage for Skylight. He'll survive, backing up. That's why held back by the Dream Coil of Thug. OG, they're not done yet. They're trying to find Thug. Thug falling low. Silence is still stunned up. Can't play his way out of this one. OG crushing the fight yet again, and they're not done yet. Jerax jumping forward. Arrow is still on cooldown, won't be able to punish Spartan. There's a smoke movement from OG as well around that mid lane. Anna, S4, seeing if they can set up for a kill. Rubik and they may also. just find it. MNT up to the high ground. S4's got eyes on him. Initial stun, beautifully catching him out. There'll be the heal from Skylark. Good turn around with the Fisher to hold them back. And they go for the jewel onto the Shadow Demon. They find themselves a kill. They've lost maybe next time, but a great dream coil for Thug. Catches one. They've got the Telekinesis on Anna. Anna has been left behind. There's the three men movement there from OG. Two are dead. All three of them are now dead. Add Finham. Making sure that when OG don't all hold hands as five and group up together. Roshan's only at half oh. HP right now. He's Can still taking so long. Him do this. They know that it's up as you mentioned. This is such a crucial fight for Advinum. They've got the big ults. They need something huge. Roshan. They need sentries is what they need. Falling low. Spawn and trying to move in. Jarek's fending him off. There's the jumping thug. That means he goes for a three-man dream coil. There any follow though, there is Madara with the Eclipse coming in close for Skylight. Getting Omni Slash by No-Tail, brought down low, the Blade Fury bringing him out of this game, but certainly Skylight's out. They've lost maybe next time, Thug jumps back in, trying again, but a beautiful stun from S4. Catches out Finham out immediately, and Thug, the last remaining survivor here, he's Jog. on his way out. And they may just get the kill as well, I mean S4. What Beautiful play. He's had a fantastic series and <laughs> it's not stopping anytime soon. This area, maybe next time, drops a sentry. I see the route the S4 is going to take. Madara. Could be in potential danger. The rest of OG are coming across. They want to make something happen here. Jump forward from S4. The arrow to follow through. And again, it's beautifully on shot. Oh. Jerax has not. He's not missing them this game, I'll tell you what. Yeah, that might have not have been that bad of a time for them to go for the duel because they used a disruption uh, during the Fissure. So there's no way to stop him from dueling at that point. But he did have the Aegis, so it probably would have been too risky. Nice for jumping in, catching out Spawn. Skylark will be there with the heal and the Percy get him out. Move forward here, and they get the duel. Anna stuck underneath the tower. That's the DK down. 54 seconds. After they're going to get a more. Thug moves forward. Gets the Dream Pro. It comes the Orb. They're going to just take the Aegis out of the hands of the Skylark. Jumps in. And we'll do with the Echo Slam. They're not four. Omni Sash comes out from no tail. He'll take that maybe next time in return. Can they catch out the Jug? Thug's hunting for him. Jukes out the arrow. He's going to continue to try and chase Jerax. And no tail on the retreat. Now looks like no tail will find a haste route and get out of there. But He's so close to their T3 tower. And he he died pretty fast as five heroes were right clicking him down. And S4 has been going for a similar play. Mm. Uh, a lot of the a lot of the games with um, Oh, 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 oh my, oh, goodness, my goodness, Skylark, he jumps in, they've only found one, they're going to find a second spot with the stolen arrow. Duel is up oh again, my what? Goodness. Are expecting a gank towards this top lane, is he going to be able to save Thug? This could be or painful, Spartan. jump in, Spartan, caught out by S4, almost certainly dead as in comes No Tail, chops him to pieces. Another huge push in from OG, S4 scanning out the sidelines at the top left. As he will find Thug. They saw that really deep observer ward, the one that's right outside the for this. I mean, S4 just jumps in, the phase shift comes in in time, and again, it's all thanks to Skylar purging off these stuns, but he can't. Oh, oh, oh Thug nearly survives, but it's not. He's not going to. No tell with these Omni Slashes. Chopping down heroes left, right, and center. 8 3 and 11 this game. 
And now 50 seconds without the puck. And they can stall with a Earth Shaker. Like Juggernaut. Yeah, he's trying to use the Echo Snap to set up onto No-Tail. Skylight jumping in with a Blade Fury and the Jewel catching him out with the Stuff Rest while holding it back here. It's four fully low, but Skylight fully low, and they've lost the Legion Commander. Madara coming in, trying to force back this high ground advance from OG. Arrow timing. Is it going to be there? Gets the chance to be giving the Fisher. They're taking down Jarek. And a trap to the high ground. They'll take the DK as well. Madara defeats the illusions there, the ultimate. I think OG's gonna have a big advantage because they have that Observer Ward and Sentry planted to the northwest of the Roshan pit. That's it, so the question if OG walk up into this one. Add Finham on the high ground, there's gonna be a jump forward, but it's on to an illusion, no, the back foot. They've managed to get the jewel up onto one of the targets, Dreamcore lays down, huge amounts of burst, they're falling down low to the Eclipse, they've lost this four, they've lost down there. They do lose Skylar, can return, MNT keeping himself alive with the Echo Slap, and the stolen on to the Slash, Spartan, Spartan! Oh my goodness, they're back! will survive but Spartan with the stolen off he's not done he jumps forward telekinesis into the face while bringing no tail down there they'll find no tail as well Madara is a little deep though he's only a chance can he actually find this kill oh my goodness this one more touch could have done it but Madara the tower will finish him off so Adfina may be going a little too aggressive there, but some incredible team plays the dream coil into the slam a beautiful dual initiation and they can just keep throwing in orbs. Ana still trying to do it, but it's still at half HP. The waiting game continues. See where the jump is. There we have it. Potentially Spawner comes forward. Telekinesis immediately followed through. Beautiful Fisher onto two. They go for the jewel onto Anna. BKB popped by Madara into the Eclipse. Anna bursts it down. He's out. The TK's down. Motel comes forward with the Blade Fury. Trying to force the back, but he's been caught in the Dream Card as well. Fight the floor with the disruption. MNT jump forward up the high ground with the free man. Echo Sam. The Fisher as well. The they're gonna find three no tails dropped as well. Skylark with the triple kill, and they may not be done yet. S4 trying to power up, but they surround him. They silence him just in time before he can dig his own grave. And four down on OT at Finham, opening up the game, opening up the Rose Champion. Well, with the F Blade and the Double Starfall and the Nick Sesson, the Nick Sesson is still very, very strong. Pushing up high ground is just too much. Yeah, so Skylark jumps forward. He has the duel. He needs some backup damage. S4 is gonna come forward with the spike carapace trying to save Anna. Anna, he's getting caught out though. Telekinesis is there. They may not get the damage bonus, but they will get the kill and Anna out for a full minute. Yeah, it's time for him to make some plays and Jerax, his job is to kill the Rubik if he can. But really he has level is. four no field. That is incredibly strong versus the Marana and the Knicks. Skylark, look at these initiations. He jumps in. We'll get caught out by the stun falling low, but Mana is there with the backup. The BKB and the Eclipse forcing OG back. No Tail jumps in with the Omni Slash. Mana is trying to retreat, taking huge amounts of damage. Spartan there with a stolen disruption, buying Mana some time. s there with a follow-up stun. And again, S4 burrowing up. No one to die as of yet. Spartan off the sideline. They come back in. There's the Echo Slash from MNT though. Catches the two backliners. Then finish on the second. Fisher from Baby next time. The stun on to He's taken as well! Wow, it was looking so bad at the oh. start of the fight. With the Aegis blown, but the support this game from Ad Finum. And Spartan still has arrow. That's very scary when you're fighting 2v4. And your three heroes off the map. Notel has a buyback, but neither S4 or Anna can think about joining the fight again. Butterfly is complete on Madara. The first reacts here, going down to the top lane fly. Attempts to jump forward, but they just jump straight back on him. And maybe next time. And that's a buyback on the Juggernaut. Oh, this could not be any better for Abfinum now at this stage of the game. A wraparound onto this push from Abfinum. The Moonlight Shadow, can they get the jump that they want? No tail to lead the way. Doug is in position to break the smoke. They do place a reserve war over there, but they see it and all of Adfinum back off knowing exactly they want to fight, where they are. They want to go in by the looks of it. Jump forward from Mana, Dragon telling one, but immediately Telekinesis to held back up. The arrow coming through, but this is going to connect. Madara gets the chance to BKB. Turn around with the Eclipse from MST. Trying to move in the center of all, looking for an Echo Slap. It's not perfect. They've lost two here, Adfinum. Dragon Tail to Thug. This time it's OG coming up on top. They've got the stone control. Thug getting taken down as well. And it looks like they're not going to just find three they're going to get four spartan oh oh okay oh it's oh my goodness jk spartan's <laughs> out of there 
So how are they going to approach this? They want to go in on the back line. Killing the Shadow Demon, I think, is the most important thing in this. If they can get the Juggernaut, maybe. But the Shadow Demon is like a guaranteed kill if they can go on him. Smoke pops. Don't see No-Tail go for the ring. And we're trying to lead in. Skylight jumps forward, gets off the duel. No-Tail needs back up. He needs it fast. MNT coming in for the back lines for the Fisher to try and block off any sort of help out. There'll be a disruption from Fly. Buying No-Tail sometime. S4 falling low to the Eclipse. No-Tail gets the Omni Slash out of this one. And he's trying to get himself away with the Blade Fury. They've lost MNT Spartan. Jumping forward with the Stolen Blade Fury. Trying to finish off S4, but S4 survives here. OG are getting themselves out of this. Anna as well, by the looks of it, able to walk it off. They'll be able to jump back in. It looks like they want to go back in for this OG. They want to try and fight Fly, will lose his life. They turn towards the Luna, surrounded here by OG. Madara needs help, but he needs it fast. He's been stunned up, controlled by S4. OG, 5-3. They're going to fight for this time for sure. Far, no way that he can play his way out of this one. Jerax finds a triple kill. 10 seconds till Shaker's back up. And maybe next time does have the Echo Slam available. Buyback can be used by Spartan as well, but they will be fighting without the Luna. They'll have to do this defense, four versus five. And it's only four versus four at the moment. Fly's still gonna wake it, make his way over. Ready the move in. Skylar's just gonna put the lead and draw. They get a good lift, bringing him on to the opposite side of the Fisher. No tail, he's in trouble. Echo Slam comes through, but no tail has a man to blade fury and the go for tree. It's a four-man tree call though. Drop down, they need follow. Skylar coming over the right clicks, no tail. He's taken down. They'll get one. Derek jumps in with the snow tail. Skylar starts to fall. They've lost Thug on the park. He's out for 90 seconds. And OG may have lost no tail. But they'll move in and attempt to finish off the mid racks. They get the range rack. This is the, the time. moonlight from, from OG. OG looking for the jump in. Yeah, S4. How many heroes can he stun? And are they going to be able to burst people down with the Soul Catcher? Madara is actually inside they, of Roche right now. They've gone back in the pit with this DD. They're trying to do it. The arrow will fly forward. And here comes the movement. Anna jumps forward. Madara with the BKB. The Eclipse starts on the back. Thug comes forward. Looking to control S4 in the midst of the pit. He yields his up with the only set from Notar. Jumps down Spartan. They've already lost one. S4 burrowing up. They're looking to control this Luna. Madara dropping low. The Dream Coil will be there. But they've already lost two on the side of Athena. Maybe next time has to blink away. They've got to get themselves the hell out of here. Thug, Skylark, and maybe next time just on the retreat now. Fly searching, but he won't won't quite find the pug. So Ad Philem lose the team fight. They lose two. Constantly stunlocked by the Nick. I'm very surprised that he hasn't gone for a BKB this game. Ad Philem looks like they're trying to pressure OG back themselves. And there's only a TP on the Nyx Assassin. None of the rest have TPs, Ben. Am I blind? No, I don't think any of them have got TPs, Ben. They haven't got TPs, Ben. They don't have they any TPs. They haven't got any TPs. And even Madara has a TP, and this melee rack is going to die. It's gone. They're having to walk all the way back. Oh, gee. They don't have any TPs. Now they're finally turning back up. But there's already someone in their base, and it's Ad Finnum. They're claiming it. Oh, he's had to through Sky like he's kept alive for the time being. No tell. is going to be turned upon. Madara just goes for the BKP, the TP out, and Ad Finnum. They're gonna get away with this one for three by looks of this Martin Blade through his TPs away. The rest are out of there. And they didn't have any TPs, Ben. Gem on Thug. Will they be able to get the jump on them? And No Tail isn't there, and he just uses BOTs. So he might be lagging behind the fight. Oh, they're actually gonna have this sentry up on the high ground. They spawn out S4, S4, using himself, dodging the Fisher, but in they come with the duel as well. But back there, Jerax in with the E-Blade. They're trying to turn this one around, OG, but Madara, he's bursting them down over the BKP in the cliffs, forcing OG back. S4's drop, they turn towards Anna and Finna. They're gonna be able to find the DK as well, but as you know, Anna turns around with the Dragon Tail back, and maybe next time they the Fisher, they found the second, and they're not done yet. Can they get no tail as well? Skylark jumping forward, maybe next time moving into position here with the Glimmer Cave set up on to fly. Then four jumps back in, but then they catch it with the adjust totem. The stolen only slash. This is Barton. They found it. He's dead. But at the same time, they've now lost the Earthshaker. Can they turn this back around? OG coming into the game, and they've done it. They found themselves not only the Earthshaker, but also Skylark Spartan. Potentially, trouble. He has to blink off in a second. Jumps up to the north. Jukes it out, TP's away, Spartan survives. And but now... two buybacks coming out there, Ben, and a dieback from S4. To the point, Ben, where it feels like whoever takes this Roche could have the game-winning push under the, underneath their, their, their belt. Oh, and it is, Ben. It oh, is. it is. He's, oh, dude, he's my. In. Nice. I mean, it is nice, Ben. Is it game-winning, though? That's the question. Oh, Went wow. for that nope. over the buyback, yeah. Ben. I mean, you've Dude, got you don't rapier. go buyback when you go rapier. Yeah. <laughs> you, you only live once with a rapier. 
and is into the pit. And already oh, trying to solo it. That didn't make the movement across. Skylark, he comes him all. Oh, oh no! He gets held back here and trying to turn with the Dragon Tail. Has been Dream Coil. Holds him up again. The Bash is actually causing issues here for Skylark under the road. But Madara with the BKB, with the Rapier. He rips down Fly. He needs to find something more. Moving into the pit. Looking for Anna, but Anna under the cover of Moonlight Shadow. He's going to be fine. Obviously, that's coming through from No Tail. They're good bounces as well. The disruption, but they've lost Spartan. Madara out. He needs to finish this up. He can't die. He cannot fall here. They need him to survive. Mama T is on the back. Madara survives thanks to Baby next time. Holding back fly. Oh my god. Madara will live to see another day. I cannot believe they saved him. Oh, oh my god. Oh, he's mid as well. He wants to push the lane. Madara. Oh, I mean, that team. Oh no, he's farming. Don't, no one died here before. Don't do it, Madara. <laughs> I mean, he's, he's managed to clear out the mid-range racks with the illusions, and it looks like he will be fine. David, he's gonna run in. He's Which going item in. is he gonna drop for? Oh, did they see that? I'm pretty sure they saw that. He has it or several were up there, but this Roshan's dropping it's really dropping fast. Really, really quick, Jax. Looking at jumping in for this one, but Madara takes it. He takes it. He drops the boots, picks up the Aegis, and now they look to fight. And Venom with the Fisher, the duel, they've caught out Adam. Madara coming forth, bombs the BKB, turns towards S4. S4, he tries to survive it, throws up, uses himself over the air, but now the Eclipse coming through. They're falling down low, the two man dream coil, S4's out, and the Triax just get himself the hell out of there. But maybe next time, and Thug, they're on the uh, chase, and look towards the sidelines, they won't clip them. I don't think they'd be here if that was an MKB right now. Yeah, I don't think so either, and Nick does not have five back they're oh. gonna have to fight this four on five could they bring it to a fourth game at finham oh no oh there's anna jumps in we need to disruption as well matter that they get the lift bring him back matter jumps forward and look at the damage the damage the damage anna falling low but there we had the e-play from jerry's keeping anna alive they've got the loose and beam and now the glaze bouncing into the dk forcing anna to retreat and they've ripped through the bottom set of racks here at finham they found a second they'll move towards the mid they're going for the mega priest can og shot them no tail turns towards them they've got the flight set up and there's the duel on the no tail Victor as well no tails oh it's fine it's fine they've got to hold here og look at the dragon tail on the matter force back there's the arrow to finish him off. He's got the Aegis ready for round two. Still, they don't have their score out for 30 seconds. Madara puts the man to start. On this next one, no doubt coming out of here. Madara kept alive again. Behind the stolen disruptions from Spartan. And a fully low. Madara is gone. He's gone down. They've lost Madara. And now OG, they're looking for the cleanup. Jump forward for Jack to start. So he's going to find another. That's going to be Skylark down. He does not have buyback available. But they did get the Mega Creeps. Madara has buyback gold. Doug has buyback gold as well. Last push. Ana oh. committing all in. Mjolnir ready. And next time has to be careful. There is a gem on Jarex. And this could be the push. I think they just go straight down. Screw oh, the rack. Lane, top lane, top lane. What's going on here? Oh, Spartan. He has buyback. No big deal. They will need it. Anna moving forward. Matter of buys back. Doug jumps forward. Immediately looking for Anna. Playing around within the back of there for Jarek's Anna's fall. Spawn steals the brief fire. Matter ready to lead in. There's going to be the E blade again. Trying to keep Matter al Anna alive. Anna at the stone of well. Matter in a lot of trouble. Matter is still up in the glimmer game. The glimmer game. Anna gets a stolen disruption and then trying to keep Matter alive. And there's no! Maybe next time buys the time that they need. Anna is out. Oh my god. And he has the rapier back in his hand. Maybe next time. Maybe next time. The Megas, they change the tier four men. Oh my god. S1. Oh, they don't, they don't, do they not have a gem? I don't see him. They don't oh, see him. Oh, buddy. S4's got the eyes on them. Matter already to move up for the push. 60 seconds still no DK. S4 currently just focusing onto Thug. Will he reveal himself? Try and jump onto Thug. Immediately blinking away as well. Up to the high ground. Burrowing up as well. He's drawing their attention away from it. Half in them, they're, they're, they're a little bit scared. Where is their gem? Where is Reveal? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you, can, you can't walk around this And they late. see him, Skylark, getting you down low. The E Blade finishing him off very, very close. And he gets blocked. Skylark's out. They've lost one. And my man T using himself up. Can he play his way out of this one? And we can't the stun again from S4. And both of those heroes actually do not have buybacks. Fight even started. Oh my god, they'll see that the moonlight was used. So I have Trying to find a pick off, they lead the way, but they've been scanned out. Oh, do you know what's up? Oh, do you scan this? They know that Adfin is making this sort of a move. Oh, maybe next time, held back by an arrow, but there's not going to be any follow through on that one. Anna starting to move forward. 
That Phenom sort of split up a little awkwardly. Maybe next time, hold No Tail back with the Yules. Now No Tail gets the Blade Fury off in time before the Fisher comes through. There's going to be the jump in. BKB the lift up on that, and Anna getting power kicked by the Eclipse. Anna's down, fights back immediately. He's going to try and get set back in the fight. The Omni Slash from No Tail onto Skylark. Skylark's out to start a fight back. They've lost Oak as well. They're two men down on Aphidum. Madara, he needs something there. There'll be a fish in the air. Chris Aphidum, MFT coming through as well. They'll get No Tail. No Tail's dead. No Tail's dead. Two minutes, no juggernaut! And they've lost oh, S4. Still no. Where's the vision? Yeah, they gotta get out of here. Yeah, it's not that. Woo! Wow. Luna survives yet another day. S4 perhaps trying to chase him down, see if he can get a pick on any of these heroes. It hasn't changed, but it's still surprising that they've been able to push out the lanes this far and are still in the really game. really well with it. But it does leave heroes false and vulnerable like this. No tail up on top. Skylight says surprise! Jumps out with maybe next time! Oh, two of them to the face, son! 82 gold needed for buyback. So right now, he oh. doesn't have it, but he can get it maybe like 50 seconds perhaps. And S4, there's smoke down mid lane, trying to push this out as soon as possible. Are they actually gonna try and make a play without the oh, jugs or not? There's a backup rapier. Backup rapier for Madara. He's got the buyback as well. This could be it. Uh, Juggernaut is up in 30 seconds, but I, I don't know if 30 seconds is going to be long enough. They could just rush for the throne. They only have five seconds oh, with the cliff. On the high ground, look at the setup. Burrows up. There's the jump in. They found the fish into the sun. It's a matter of what the BKB, the Eclipse. They focus down S4, but he uses himself up. Buys time, but they're already moving forward. They're heading for the big kills. Looking for Anna. Skylight's taken down the Shadow Demon with the jewel. S4 jumps forward, looks for the stun. The Omni has for no doubt. They found Skylight. Matter drops low, but he's got the Aegis. He's going to be back for round two. Buy back for Skylight. Bosses across, getting himself back in the fight. And he comes Spartan again with the stolen Omni Slash. Jumps down Anna. The engine is open. They're looking to finish the game here. Maybe next time looking for Jack, but Madara is hitting the engine. The engine's falling low. And Abdullah, who on the verge of doing it? Oh, maybe next time comes in with the Echo Slam. They just need a few more touches on that engine. It's incredibly low. Can they do it? Don't jump forward. Looking to finish it, but he's not going to do it. The OG have held. They have held. 310 HP left on the Dire Ancient. Uh, they could technically just smoke up and finish it off with I mean, their next buyback. I don't, I don't think maybe next time goes for that There sort of is play. just way too much armor on that Ancient. 15 oh, he, armor? He, is he, is no, he going no, he's for not, it? No, he's not. He is. No, he's he not. He is going no, for it. No, he's not. He's not. Oh, oh, my God. 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 Oh, my I can't believe he did it! I can't believe he's gonna done it! What an absolute no! <laughs> They've done it, man! It's not the 3-0 that it looked to be! It's 2-1! And Philip have taken a game against OG! His smiles on no tail! His smiles on me! <laughs> and Philip coming out, they can't believe it!